Sandra Clough and Innovision talking about health and well-being today. It's a bit difficult actually because I definitely don't look at my desk today and as you can see I have a bit of an injury going on here. So what can I talk about today? Well I know that by the time this comes out all this will be healed up and that will be the end of that. So I'm being brave and exposing myself because I think it's a I think my vlogs are about being real, but every every time you see me, normally I've got my makeup on and my hair's all done and I'm grinning away. But I do have an issue that I think is that a lot of people have, and it's called duaholism. And I think, particularly since I've worked for myself, more so than ever. But I've been like it most probably most of my life, and it's I never quite seem to get enough done. And I have lots of job lists and lots of to-do lists. And it's now half past eight at night. It's the England football's on tonight. One of my sons is here watching it. And I've made a commitment to do some work in the office till 10 o'clock, which isn't my norm. I normally do my work during the daytime. But I've got a lot of clients, which is great. But there's a lot of things I need to catch up with. But yesterday, I walked into the oven because I was doing something that I really try and avoid doing that was multitasking and I was I had the oven door open and I went on and did another job and I went to put something away and bash really smashed myself in the face and it was quite a sort of whoa you know um, a reminder of how I need to slow down a little bit and just do the next smallest right thing in front of me and I don't know why I have so much urgency some days are worse than others but yesterday, clearly, there was a lot going on. But today, as a result of it, I've really slowed down. And I have done a lot today, but I've been much more mindful and much more present. You know, I did some yoga in the garden, went to my bike ride and went to the cinema and done quite a lot of work as well. So I just want to encourage people that not to beat yourself up when you make a mistake, but really look at what you can do different. And really try and implement that because nothing happens without action really. So I'd like to say that by exposing myself today, warts and all, that I maybe help and encourage somebody else. So maybe look at what you're doing that's not working for you and really practice doing something different that does work for you. Or otherwise there are consequences. And as you can see, I'm sitting with the consequences of my own actions. Bless me.